Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. And yes, you're still with me right here on COD Realty and Properties. This is a new year and I want to say happy, happy, happy new year to all my subscribers. Yes, first my subscribers and to everybody that by chance would find a way to watch this particular um, video from this amazing channel that talks about anything and everything real estate. Now in the year 2022, I promise you to give you amazing home tours. And for those of you who sometimes say, is Ghana a concrete jungle? Why aren't you showing us property that have gardens? Why are you putting graph with dogs? <laughs> Every time I see comments like that, I'm like, yo! I'll give you exactly what you're looking for. I promise you that. I'll try my possible best to look for properties and for developers that gives you the all-round feel of everything that you request on this channel. 2022 is going to be an amazing year. I know you've written down what you want to achieve for 2022, and I know that you are definitely going to achieve them. One of my achievements is that I should have, say, 2K subscribers, just 2K subscribers before the first month ends and maybe 5k before the first quarter ends and you need to help me do that by subscribing to this channel and hitting the bell so that every time we load a video right here on this channel you'll be the first person to get that notification and share with your friends share with your family tell a friend to tell a friend to tell another friend that if you want to know about real estate you should be on this channel welcome to my channel once again and today we are going to be talking about why you should invest in Ghana's real estate market. Let's go! So someone will say why should I invest in Ghana? Why is this guy always here showing me homes talking about investment and why I should be in Ghana? Now one of the interesting facts that you should know is that in 2019, Ghana received over 1.3 million tourists from all over the world. Every continent, people would just troop in for the year of return. And everybody was amazed about how Ghana is gradually developing. Now in the year 2020 to 2021, Ghana has received over 1.5 million visits from all over the world. Now, that should tell you that gradually Ghana is becoming one of the amazing, say, favorite tourism hub in Africa. So you should be in Africa. Yes, you should be in Africa. And that is why you need to invest in the real estate market in Ghana. So somebody would ask, where do I start from? And that is why I'm here. So you can actually decide to be a developer by way of investment, you can be a developer. So a developer is one that comes into the real estate market, looks for a piece of land, and decides to put up a structure, say an apartment, a townhome, a house, an office complex, a warehouse, a hotel, anything at all that you put on that particular land can actually introduce you into the real estate market. Or you can actually come into the real estate market as a financier. So you give me a call, say COD Realty and Properties, I want to partner with you. I have some, some amount of money there and I want to partner with you. Get us a land, represent us in Ghana, move around. Let's do some amazing townhomes. Let's do some apartments. And I'm actually open to that because in the year 2022, I want to hit the ground. And so, yes, you should call me. Let's have a conversation on how you can be a financier. You partner and then you get it done. Now, the third part that you can actually use that medium to be a real estate investor is to have the opportunity to own a home, what we call you a homeowner. So you can decide to grab yourself an apartment, a townhome, a house, anything at all. Did I really say anything at all? It's because I like the word to say. But yes, you can grab yourself an apartment, a townhome, um, and a house. And then you can be a homeowner and start to buy rent, buy, rent, buy, rent, or buy low and sell high. So you can get a property where it's really not the standard of the market currently, and then you would renovate and refurbish it into a beautiful home, and you can actually sell it for an amazing price. Real estate investment is actually one of the safest form 
of investment because you are investing in a market that increases in value every single time. And once your property is insured, you are always safe. And so real estate investment is one of the investment opportunities that anytime is being presented to you, you need to take that chance. Now about Ghana's real estate market, let's listen to what the celebrity said in an interview and what some of them tweeted about Ghana and how Ghana is a conducive environment for investment. Invest everything in Africa, man. Okay, that's the goal. That's that's where everything needs to be invested. That's, that's where you're gonna get your value and your investment back. Yeah, I'm from Ghana, so my parents are from Ghana. Ghana's, the amount of, Amer the amount of Americans right that come into Ghana no, right now. I'm telling you, you guys are sleeping. <sighs> Y'all sleeping, man. I'm uh, telling you. They literally do a lot. Listen of to me, you guys I'm are listening. sleeping, especially uh -huh. all the Ghanaians here in, in 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 the UK. Talk to them. Talk to them, bro. What if you guys are not investing right now? You're missing. The, you're missing all the opportunity. You're literally missing the opportunity. By the time you guys figure it out, it'll be too late. Damn. I promise you. you I'm need trying, to invest. bro. I'm trying. Listen to me. I'm hearing you. Imagine New York City before it was New York City. Oh, bro. The one family that understood the value, which was the Rockefellers, they owned the city. All those buildings and land that they invested is all paying off today because they got in early. Ghanaians have that access right now. As you know, the property value is raising and going up higher and higher every year. When you got access to grab it all right now, they're going to build on it. It's, it's, that's the only place left to develop. So whatever dollar you have or pound, trust me, you need to buy land in Ghana or anywhere in Africa ASAP. Man, starting the year, uh, going to Ghana. Why Ghana? Because, like, that's the only place I have, like, actual genuine peace. Man. Okay. You get me? It's like when you go to, like, Labadi Beach and then you're looking in the water, man. And then, like, you see there's this line at the end where it's, like, it separates the sky from the water. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's where God lives. So you started in Ghana? Yeah. Had got, then, got your peace? And then yeah. when, where next? I go on mad robot mode. Mm -hmm. Where it's like I'll do like four shows a day. Right, yeah, right? yeah. At the end, I'll just break down. The totally. robot breaks. <laughs> yeah. And then that's when I go to Ghana. Right. <laughs> so, according to the Ghana Investment Promotion Center on property development, I'm just giving you information from them. It says that Ghana's property development sector has seen a steady upsurge over the past decade as a result of steady economic growth, rising population, and rapid urbanization. And I earlier on spoke about the tourists coming in and out of the country. And so you should know that definitely there would be a need to get more housing units. And currently, officially, we estimate a country's current housing shortfall or deficit of about 2 million housing units. Wow. 2 million housing units. We need about 2 million housing units. And so you need to come invest back at home. And you that is already in Ghana, you need to start investing in houses. So we need to solve this particular housing deficit problem. Information by top property developers in Ghana revealed that about 850,000 building facilities are either rented or sold on an annual basis with an average return of 18% on the said properties. So you actually have great returns on investment. And so when you're investing in the Ghanaian property development market is one thing that you shouldn't even take chances with. You should just go in right there. Now, from the Ghana Investment Promotion Center, they say that the mortgage market, however, remains a developing state, remains in the developing state. And that is the big question. I always get people from the diaspora asking me questions about how they can use mortgages to buy a home. And when I give them 
um, a brief on it, they get discouraged. But this is why we are inviting more investors to come in because this is what's happening. By the Oxford Business Group report, they put together a ratio of mortgage to GDP at 1.1%, largely due to the inability of the banks to allocate capital for long-term financing. So the banks are willing, but the funds are not being made available. So when they are doing the allocations, they can allocate for long-term funding because what is a mortgage? A mortgage is like a note. It's like you want to purchase a property and then a bank comes in and provides a note to the developer, to the owner of the property to say that, yes, we are coming in to pay on behalf of Madam Susu and So or Mr. Susu and So. And then they do the purchase on your behalf and you are given a duration plus an interest to pay back. We'll go more into mortgages, but what I'm actually saying is that we need investors from all around the world to look into investing to solve that shortfall of about 2 million housing units right here in the country. And so everybody is invited and it's everybody's tax to look into the Ghanaian real estate market and to invest. The apartments coming up, the town homes coming up, there are other interesting developments coming up in the year 2022 that you should not take a chance with. You should just grab it, grab it like that. Yeah, you should grab that opportunity and invest in the real estate market. My name is Chris Elton Desmond of COD Realty and Properties, and I just want you to have that confidence in us that every time you think about anything real estate in Ghana, we are the ones you should speak with because we are ready to serve you with anything and everything real estate. If you have not yet subscribed to our channel, please hit the red subscribe button, hit the bell right close to it, like, share, comment on our videos, and in the year 2022, any topic you want us to discuss on the channel, this is an opportunity to comment. Tell us what you want to know and what do you think that we should talk about so that it will help all of us to understand where we are heading to um, as a real estate industry right here in Ghana. And until next time, I always tell you, au revoir.